Hey guys, Sergeant Retro. Um, I got some more Black Ops 3 news today, and the news is that um, uh, I made a video like 35 minutes ago talking about the cover art and description of Black Ops 3, and there's people thinking that Black Ops 3 is going to have excellent suits, and people, some people think that it's not. So I'm going to read this article from Charlie Intel talking about that, and uh, hopefully you guys enjoy the commentary and the gameplay. Um, after the teaser went live, there was still no confirmation on which time period the next Call of Duty war would be in. The safest bet was that it would be a direct sequel to Black Ops 2 and take place near the year 2025, when the original took place, which was still often referred to as the near future setting. However, a couple hours went by and the main Black Ops 3 key art and description was leaked where it was made clear that Black Ops 3 might, ev might be even further in the future than most thought. Now all the buzz and chatter in the community is centered around the soldier's suit and appearance, unlike past Call of Duty titles where it was, clear, it was very clear what kind of gear the soldiers had on. Now it's a very hot topic debate, mainly because of the brightness and quality of the photo and the fact that it was leaked before any details of the game have been revealed. We can tell you that after monitoring all the social media feeds and reading all the comments and the latest articles, the vast majority immediately assumed it was an exosuit. In turn, everyone automatically assumed the gameplay would be identical to Advanced Warfare. We don't fall in that category. It is our opinion based on how it looks and based on the latest the leaked description of the game that the soldiers in cyber cyber nanetic, ne, sorry guys cyber cyber nanetic enhanced is similar in the sense that it's an enhanced soldier but that doesn't necessarily mean it's going to play like advanced warfare in fact we've heard the opposite if recent rumors and leaks are being believed and they've been pretty accurate so far the game will be a focus more on waiting on wall running than double jump and still have familiar call of duty fast based gameplay that still doesn't sell the future and advanced war that still doesn't settle the future and world at war 2 argument it's pretty clear that black ops 3 is taking the future route route but this isn't a follow-up to Advanced Warfare in any way that this will be Treyarch's take on future robotic warfare. Sorry guys about the commentary. <laughs> uh, I had trouble trying to read some of the words. So, there's people on one side thinking that Black Ops 3 are going to have soldiers with exosuits. And there's another side thinking that there's not going to be um, exosuits. Um, the, uh, the people that think that it's not going to be exosuits think it, it might be armor suits or cyber genetic enhancements to their um, armor. So, what do you guys think? Do you guys think that it's going to be exosuit or or it's not? So, I'll have the um, cover art link in the description. Cause I told you last time my editing software doesn't allow me to um, put photos like on the side of my videos so I can't show you guys the photo on the video so um, I'll have the link to that in the description and that's pretty much it guys um, I'll have more Call of Duty Black Ops 3 news in a few hours if there is any if there's any news about Black Ops 3 in any hours later on or any days I'll tell you guys about it 